All right, so we're back down. That space that I was just at that you saw was up there. So that's where that is. We come out over here. And we got a lot of construction stuff going on. Previous tenant that had the spot is moving out in there. This bay is 20 feet tall and over 20 feet, about 20 feet wide and 60 feet long. We're gonna have all the floor treated. We're gonna have the kennels running all the way down. There's floor drains in the center so that we could squeegee open the bays. We're gonna have 14 AC vents dumping ice cold air into this bay. We got ourselves the dumpster. We got dumpster service out here. We go back inside the building. So we're gonna have to trench out this area so that we can have all the overflow from when we're cleaning, which comes out from the sides of the buildings. We're in the process of cleaning up back here. This is where we're gonna break the dogs at, right? So when your dog needs to go potty, we're gonna take them out here, the outdoor or and or train out here. We're also gonna put kennels all along the back of this area so the dog can be outside for some periods. Like I said, this is the dog kennel. We're able to open both sides of the bay, fresh air, or close it down and pump a lot of AC. So one of the big things that I've always done is thoroughness in my business. So on those hot days, if we have power interruption, we, I think right here, this is a 500 and a 250 propane that we have that powers the Generac system for the entire location so that if we lose power, the dogs are still gonna stay ice cool with our Generac system. Pretty exciting. So we do have another guy over here that has this building, but we're also able to set up all of our outdoor obedience and stuff like that in this huge area up front. And that's the tour guys. I'll keep you updated uh, as we increase and finish out the build out.